welcome to Vlogmas. It is Vlogmas day 21. The first thing I'm going to bake, it was going to be the dog ones, but I'm going to do them this afternoon. The first thing I'm going to bake, sorry about that. If I ever have a dog to fix it. The first thing I'm going to bake is sugar cookies and craving cookies. And I love sugar cookies. So, I'm not going to do the preheating oven, but I'm going to use my cake factory oven. That you would have seen in probably one of my other videos. So I don't have to do that. Shift together flour and baking and salt and set aside. Okay. So, flour. So I need, for the first bit, I need flour. I don't have salt. I only have the hard salt. So I'm not going to add salt to it. So, whatever. Let's see how it goes. Sugar. And butter. So I'm going to sort out the butter first. But I probably would need to soften that. So, I need to get another bowl for that. And I'm not sure if I got a shift, shift needle. So that's something that should work. Let's see. Sorry about this, everyone. No, I don't. Okay. Have a go to get the mushroom spoon. So I'm just going to put them in and just see how it goes. So, one and a half hot cups. So I need to get a cup. I got this. Hopefully, it got cups on it. It's stuff. It's, it does not stuff. So, two, so I'll need to fill this up twice to the top there. No, that'll be one and a half. Then I would need to do one. Okay, I'll get see what I need to do. So now I'll do the flour. Pour the flour in. Second, a bit more. So that's the first one and a half. So now I need to do one. Give me a second. So I got flour on my phone. And I need that for the... Bit more. Give it to me, I can need to put it back. Yeah, that's too much. That close now. So that's the flour. Flour now baking. Baking powder, I forgot to bring that round, but got it out. The bird, let me open it. Sometimes you have to use your teeth to open these. I hope the whole thing came off. Whatever. So it's One tablespoon. So I look for the tablespoon here. That's hard. There. So it's this one for baking powder. 
then that one. So I've done flour and baking powder. So it will two and a half cups of flour and one tablespoon of baking powder. So I've done that bit, so you set that aside. So I need another bowl for the next bit. And the next bit is butter and sugar. So I'll put the sugar in first. Oh, no, butter first, but I need to put that in the microwave. And the amount of butter is three fourth cup. So three fourth. That's a lot. Alright. So we get a teaspoon so I can get the butter. Didn't realise how much butter you would need to make sugar cookies. Nearly there. I say that's enough. Well, got enough butter there, I would say. So put it in here so I can soften it. But when it's softened, this should be the right amount. Put that in the microwave for a couple of seconds. Just to soften it. So I'm going to put 30 seconds and checking it. 30 seconds is quite long, but it should do it. Seconds. Yeah. Now I will say that perfect now. So I've got softened butter. It might be too softened, but who cares? And the sugar I need to put one cup. So I've got one cup of sugar. That's a lot of sugar as well. And now you mix it. Got through, so now I mix it to make it into a cream. And that's step three. So I'll say that done. Now step four. Beat in eggs and vanilla. So it one large egg. Need to wash my hands again. So 
I need the extract? So how much extract do I need? Half a tablespoon. So this one. So I'm doing the extract now. So I've done that. Then beat in the that. I'm still beating. Don't do that. Now, now you add the stuff you've done in the other bowl. So I'm gonna. So I'm gonna grab this. Grab the stuff I did before, and I'm gonna pour this in here. Then you mix it until it makes a coffee type texture. You can use a machine that you've got or your hands. But I'm just going to use a spoon to mix until it gets to the consistency that I want it. And this bit, you sh if you do need to move to another machine, you can go and do that. Yeah, I'm going to get my machine out. It'll be easier. Sometimes you have to use the stuff you've got, and that's fine. Find the button. After the back. So, take the machine, I'm going to pour this in. Take this off. So, I'm going to put in here. To my bit, not all goes in. Don't need just... this. Do you test it to get the rest of this thing? Then I put this back onto the machine, the 10 wood mixer. Then mix on low setting until blended. So I'll be back once it's blended. So now it's blended, I'm going to grab some flour. And put it on this thing I'm going to use to flatten it and to make it into a shape. And I'm going to grab what I can. Oh, that's a bit too much. So if I got too much flour, I can move it to the side. This is the amount I'm using first, and I do have more. So I'm going to flatten it. Going to put some flour in here. So when it goes in here, it will stick. I'm not using a rolling pin because I just don't want to. Then you grab your cutter that you're going to use. First one I'm going to use is a snowman. And you cut the shapes. Doesn't have to be perfect. Then I'm going to use a stocking for the next one.
Now, the next one. You just grab some more. I think I got too much flour on that. So, the way to correct that is by adding more of the dough. So, if it does break and you've still got loads of dough left, add more dough to it, then it should stop cracking. And if it does crack and stuff, to put those bits to the side. And try me. Gonna make another stocking. And while I make these, I'm gonna make some cupcakes as well. Let's see if I can fit this. No, no, I can't. Might be able to do better do that. Yeah, perfect. Now I'm doing another snowman. Then I go on everything. If they do start going together, it doesn't really matter. I'm gonna make some cupcakes as well with it and the way I'm going to do that by going to flour in these there and the way you're going to do cupcakes is to grab it put it in a bowl and put it in there you need to grab some more dough I'm going to grab a lot of dough this time. That's enough dough this time. So now you shape it. Then after you've done that, you grab a bit and you put it in there, put it in here, press it down, so just that. And you do that in all of them. I'm going to put that on there. Doesn't matter if they're not all the same shape or size or anything, that bit doesn't matter. Then I've done the ones in there. Now I'm going to do some long ones. Where well, I'm going to use this one. So I'm going to make long cookies. cleaning in a bit so when you're done that you grab a bit Now, don't put these off. I need to get another one of these out and start cutting them into shapes. And I'm going to do that over here, and I'm going to pour them out so you know what shape I'm doing. I'm going to pause it and come back when I start baking them. So now I've finished making them, I'm going to put the first load in to be cooked. 
So I put them in the machine I'm using. Look for, oh, Look for a plug and I can put it over here. Give me a minute. So now I plug it in here. So it's plugged in. Turn it on. I'm going to put it on that one, the cake one for 20 minutes and stop and in a few minutes I'm going to come back and check it and I'm going to put the stuff away that I use that need to go in the fridge then I'm going to just sit down for a bit grab the eggs then when they're cooked I'm going to do tidy it but then i can tidy everything in one go then move on to the next bit so stay tuned for me making dog biscuits and trying out the ones i made so stay tuned for more i know i said i was gonna do dog biscuits but i ran out of time today so i'm gonna try and do them tomorrow so that will be tomorrow's video um so whatever i said i'm gonna do in tomorrow's video i'll do the day after if it fits in and with Christmas and everything. And if not, <coughs> sorry. If not, it's okay. So tomorrow video will hopefully be me doing dog biscuits. But the sugar cookies I made are 100% delicious. Would highly recommend. Look got your text message. Highly recommend. Um... Hope you enjoyed that video. Stay tuned for another Vlogmas. Bye.